Hey everyone, it's Lauren here. I am so lucky because I have been asked to be the guest designer for Felicity Jane in this month of June, which doubles as a, a bonus because it's my birthday month as well. So what a treat for me to be asked to design a couple of scrapbooking products using their beautiful June kit, which is Catherine. So I thought I would share Catherine with you. Um, yes, yeah, so when Felicity Jane products arrive, you get this gorgeous black and white striped box and open it up and it's wrapped beautifully in this beautiful black and white tissue paper with that lovely scalloped edge um, and this delightful little bow there. Um, so yeah, so here is Catherine. I'm going to save that bow for a project. We get a gorgeous little title card which gives you a little bit of an indicator of the colour theme of the month and a little thanks for your order. So that one is 3 by 4 inch so you can use that in your pocket style scrapbooking. And then um, here's Catherine. So we might start with the papers first. gorgeous tissue paper aside and the what does it say it says six 12 by 12 double sided pattern papers and you get a great little um, reference strip here which has a sort of a just a sampler of the papers that you're going to get and obviously we can fussy cut those. We've got a cute little scalloped edge there and we've got this black and white strip that you could use in your scrapbooking projects as well. We've got a June title card and look how delightful this little floral is. If you haven't heard of Felicity Jane I'm going to put a link in the description below so you can go and check out uh, this scrapbooking kit company. You can also buy their products individually uh, which I I may show you the extra goodies I added on to my, my package in a second and um, and it's a boutique, I would describe it as a boutique scrapbooking kit club so everything is really beautiful and very thought out right down to the packaging, right down to the you know the delivery, the box, everything. It's sort of like a just a little bit, I'm not sure, boutique is the word that's coming to mind. So here we go, this one is called Flowers and Stars and it's a beautiful floral with a two-tone peachy pink there and that lovely, lovely soft green. And here is a tiny little black and white, almost grey actually I would say, a grey and white star. We've got the the red gingham down there as the reference strip that you could cut as well. So there's that one. We have this gorgeous, I'm not sure what we would describe this colour, it's almost a deep apricotty colour and it's got a beautiful white diagonal stripe through there. So really classic, beautiful, strong colour, perfect for matting your photos. And a, on the back is a black and white, really cute little whimsical scalloped edge there and a star strip down the bottom there in yellow and white for you to add on a project as well. Oh look at these delightful, these look like little berries. If you can see that, that's in that darker colour again with the little leaves there and it's called Berry and Dot and here is a beautiful mint and white small polka dot piece and a delightful little heart strip down there to use. Here we have is a beautiful stripe called Stripes and Sparkles and how sweet is, is this? Just that beautiful colour palette continuing along a perfect foundational piece and on the back we've got this beautiful star and in white and that's a really deep grey almost black there so lovely lovely here we have a um, beautiful, beautiful soft peachy pink there with a soft white 
little floral elements in there, leaves, and this is called Floral and Spots. And over here is a whimsical black and white spot there, just you, that sprinkling of fine black polka dots is sweet. And how cute is that little condensed floral border there. Here we have a yellow with a pale yellow heart, a super tiny little heart, super sweet. And this one's called Hearts and Stars. And on the back is a beautiful, beautiful, look at these gorgeous clusters of floral uh, stars in that beautiful colour palette. It's like little, little galaxies. <laughs> Down the bottom we've got a classic black and white stripe there for you to use. And that's a really lovely piece. Here we go, we've got a solid here with a um, little scalloped edge that you could use on there. And there's the other colour. So it's really, these ones just must be that classic solid cardstock in that beautiful colour palette. So that is the gorgeous papers. There we go. Now we can move on to the 3x4 cards. So you get a little pack of 3x4 um, cards, perfect for your pocket style scrapbooking. And this one here is, says Happy and just a little light grey grid, a yellow and white stripe with a classic, another classic grid there, beautiful bold letters and a grid on the back. This is me, another grid on the back, a beautiful stripe, the full colour palette there and a grid dot on the back and this beautiful strong punchy colour. I love that with that fine little white polka dot. And that's the dot on the back. And a light pink, peachy pink with a white star. That's a beautiful soft one there. That gorgeous little, oopsies, <laughs> that gorgeous little floral arrangement there. The gingham. My current faves and the dots so you can list off your current faves. Those gorgeous little berries. And this beautiful, I'm not sure, check there. And that all those colour tones looks like they're layered on top of each other. So they're the cards plus that is the title card for the collection. And then we also got some little library cards, like borrower cards. These are sweet and that comes in all the colour palette there. So, author, title, date, borrower's name. There you go. Oh, that's nice with the little signature floral there, the Catherine floral. And there's those colours. So that's a beautiful little collection. So there's all the beautiful cards that you could use for layering up on your scrapbook layouts. You could use them in your traveller's notebooks or you could use them in your uh, Project Life albums. So next up we have I'll just pack them up there. Next up we have some gorgeous Catherine vellum frames. There's six pieces. I love vellum. It's so soft. So we've got a gorgeous, hang on, let's see if I can put them on here. A gorgeous little floral one. Then we have a classic black and white check. The gorgeous stripes. Super fun. Oh goodness, this is sweet. Look at these, the little berries. That whimsical little polka dot, black and white. And oh, this is gorgeous. Look at the rainbow. How lovely is that? So, a lovely little collection of soft vellum frames. We also got a stamp set. And this is Week in Review, all the days of the week. Currently loving, watching, reading, all the weekdays in the full word. The little Catherine floral arrangement there so you can build your own little cluster. I want to remember this and these gorgeous little classic circles that you can add your days in and build little, 
build little things. So that's a really gorgeous little set there. Comes in. Look at these cute little. I'm not sure whether you can see that, but it's a little scalloped edge plastic sleeve for your stamp set. We also got some essential label stickers in the colour palette. Oh, these are really thick and lovely. And they have, if you can see, this one's got lines, this one's got dots. This one's sort of like a notebook, another grid, and these are the plain solid ones. And they come... You've got the little tabs there that indicate the colour and you've got all those pages of tags and tabs which are perfect for those stamp set that's adding that date, adding the days, adding that little bit of journaling and I use these on my pocket style scrapbooking layouts. Oodles and oodles just to write those little sentiments, those little thoughts and feelings that that photo that, that the photo or the little moment gives you just to write or might be a, something that someone's just said to, a little a little speech bubble or something like that a record a funny moment a joke something along those lines so that's really cute little set there then we have some beautiful puffy stickers these are super sweet They've actually, if you can see, have a little bit of texture in there, like purposely printed, like they're smooth, but the pattern is actually a texture. And how cute is that little pie? Love this. Happy day, a little tag, good times, a gorgeous little floral, dream, heart, a cute little rainbow, an ampersand, and today, a bow, and that little berry. Really, really cute those. Then we've got a alphabet in a beautiful classic font there in all the colour range. Love that you get numbers. I always love numbers and they are in a puffy sticker. So they are super sweet. Alright and now we have the ephemera. Give you a little close up look there. Look, oh, look at all these gorgeous bits. Oh my goodness. Oh, they're everywhere. Look at these floral. Oh, there's Catherine. <laughs> Isn't she delightful? Look at her. There's the three tags. My story. Little tab currently. About me. Chapter number six, a nice little floral, another little one, some classic little hearts, and some of the stars that match the little stars featured on the in the paper collection. Notes, a little life update. There's those sweet little berries, a cute little polka dot heart and some numbers. We've got three, five, one, four and two. <laughs> and there's another little journaling tab and another little banner. So that is a super cute little uh, die cut collection there and that is Catherine, actually, I think there is something else. Here we go. Here's the Catherine Traveller's Notebook. So let's have a look. I haven't... This is my first Felicity Jane Notebook. And I actually thought last night, maybe I should be trying this Traveller's Notebook stuff out a bit more. Oh, look at that. That is a beautiful, classic, bright white, plain plain booklet traveller's notebook and it's got that gorgeous Catherine colour colour scheme there and how beautiful is that so yeah you might be seeing a tra my a, a traveller's notebook spread using this beautiful collection out of me so there you go there's Catherine I hope you love her if you haven't heard of Felicity Jane check it out in the description 
below. The link will be in the description below and go and check Catherine out and all the other beautiful Felicity Jane girls. I'm going to, I did a bit of a shopping haul, but I've just realized how long this video is going for. So I'm going to add another video with my little shopping haul. So check back to my channel and you will see that shopping haul there if you want to see more Felicity Jane goodies and what I've been shopping for. All right, guys, take care. Bye.